Hello and welcome to some Animal Crossing New Horizons. Look, it's snowing. Oh, I hope I'm dressed appropriately. <laughs> um, it's very early. I don't have much of a voice yet. It's just a little after 6 a.m. And I remembered I have an empty plot I need to fill today. So I'm logging in for some uh, villager hunting. I don't think I have very many Nook Mouths tickets in my storage, probably a dozen or so. So, oh, let's listen to Isabel. Good morning, Isabel. Yes, it's very early. And today we've had the first snow of the year. Winter has finally arrived, Turtle Time. <laughs> you know, I heard Flick is taking time off here on Turtle Time. Okay, good. Flick's here. Oh, I only have two tarantulas. I was hoping to have three for him. <laughs> I'm going to have him make me for funsies, though I have three snails. I think I'm going to have him <laughs> commission a piece of art with snails. So, um, Punchy has moved out. And we need a peppy or a jock. Oh, and if you watched my video yes from yesterday, whoa, forming sentences is tricky when you've only been awake a half hour. Um, I moved my house. I'm kind of making like a little lakefront vibe here. Yeah, I sold a bunch of stuff. I rather than going into the shop, I've just been using the Dropbox because I keep I you know was getting tired of hearing about their sale, which ends today. Um, so yeah, I I kind of ended my river. Uh, made a very small lake, <laughs> very small. I kind of this is a case now where resident services is in the way of my <clears throat> excuse me, sorry, my lake. <laughs> So I have a little patio here. I love the look of these chairs, but I don't like that you can't get into them from the side. You have to pull them way far away from the table to sit in them. So I need something that works better for the bistro table. So I still have to figure out what I'm gonna do as far as decorating and stuff around here. I still don't know if I'm gonna move my farm over here, or maybe I'll just put some houses here. I really don't know. So let's check our mail and let's go get our Nook Miles tickets. Oh, just from Quilson. He sent us a little gift. Let's see. You know that my style is always on point from head to toe. And sometimes when I see something that would look good on someone else, I get it for them. Well, today's your lucky day. Oh, I can't wait to see what he has sent us to wear. They pick just the loveliest of hats and things. All right, slip on loafers. That's better than like the bandaged <laughs> head wrap I got the other day. Although to be fair, it did match the color of the outfit I was wearing. <clears throat> we'll just put those away. I wanna go in my happy little gyroid room. I need the recipe, if there is one for the hanging shelves, or I just need to go buy it maybe from the Happy Home Paradise or Mordell. I still love this room. I know it's not the, I don't know, not exactly what I had envisioned, but it's a good start for the amount of materials I have. <laughs> oh, my mind is not awake yet. My nose is still stuffy. <laughs> My throat's not awake, but it's like, hey, perfect time to play. I want to get some house cleaning. Oh, yeah, 14. I want to get some house cleaning done later today so I can uh, get out our Christmas tree and stuff tomorrow. Fortunately, I think it's all stored uh, in our little... We have like a little laundry room with storage and stuff in it. I think everything is in there where I can actually reach it. <laughs> I'm only a little over five foot four and sometimes my husband puts stuff up um, where I can't get to it and then I have to bug him. So this way it'll be a nice surprise. I can get it all out and get the house decorated while he's at work. I don't know why I'm running this way other than I just, I really am liking how this is turning out. And I love Look at all the little sparkly, polleny, dusty stuff. 
Okay, on to the airport, sorry. <laughs> Still trying to figure out what to do over here. <laughs> I don't know yet. Okay, seriously now, on to the airport. <laughs> I don't know if I want to use, like, I really like some of the new, um, you know, we already had the teacup ride and now there's like that, uh, is it like a little Ferris wheel or whatever? I really like those things. I think they're fun. I just don't know if I have a room, room for it on my island. Uh, I want to fly. I actually had to think for a second, did I get the Nook Miles tickets? So yeah, maybe I shouldn't do a recording just within 30 minutes of getting out of bed. I've actually been awake for a while and I was just lying in bed watching TV. And thought, well, nope, we gotta go villager hunting. <laughs> oh, and my cat Scarlet was yelling at me. She had food. My husband is so sweet. He feeds the animals before going to work, including getting Scarlet her little dish of wet food. But she wouldn't go eat it. She just went and would sit in the hallway between my office and our bedroom and just yell and yell and yell till I would get up and come sit in here with her while she ate. And then she only took like two or three bites and then went back into the bedroom for a nap. <laughs> I do not understand that cat at all. <laughs> uh, let's check for a message in the bottle first. Uh, we're definitely looking for... Um, a Peppy or a Jock. I do not have either of those personality types right now. So I, I really got to kind of stick to my guns and get one of those. I didn't do it last time. I caved when I saw Drago because I had him on, oops, on my old island. And I just missed him so much. He's so cute. The little dragon who says burn. So... <laughs> Um, the plan is... <laughs> Peppy or Jock? I just have to keep reminding myself. Peppy or Jock? Um, uh, I don't think you are a Peppy. Well, there's a fresh face. Are you visiting from another island as well? Yes, Gloria. Uh, let me turn my game sound up. I can barely hear it. There we go. I hope that doesn't affect the recording. I feel like sometimes I get a little tinny or echoey sound. Okay, my listening device didn't chime in. And so I've been turning my speakers down a little bit lower, but I don't think that affects it. Uh, okay, I know you're always down to dish, darling. That's what I love about the snooties. Oh, I need that. I'm not going to gather resources. It would take forever. I did that. I've been trying to kind of stockpile stuff. Been trying to craft one of everything. All right, let's head back. Hopefully we can find a peppier jock within our 14 tickets. Um, my husband still has, I think, about 20 or 30 tickets that I gave him when we both restarted our islands and I was clearing stuff out of my old island before I deleted it. And he's not playing yet. <laughs> so, um, I, I, I may steal, steal, uh, steal away onto his island and, and sneak into his stash. I meant to say sneak onto his island and steal from his stash. <laughs> hmm. Oh, this hot tea is good, but it's actually getting cold so fast. Okay, we want to fly. Yep. Let's go. Use Nook Miles tickets. Oh my gosh. I'm really having to think a lot. <laughs> That's just a little sad. Come on, Orville. Send us to a good one. I haven't even had breakfast yet or anything. I need to, I'm actually still in my jammies. It's getting a little cold in here, so I might have to pause this to go get my bathrobe or turn on the heater. I'm having very nice weather though. Mm -hmm. 
First, we'll check the beach. Because I need so many DIYs. So I can't, I don't, well, I mean, I can afford to miss one. Not a big deal. But I really don't want to miss any. No. Nope, no message over there. Oh, little koala. Cute. Hello. Hello. Oh, didn't expect that voice. Wasn't expecting to run into, well, much of anyone out here. Wherever here is exactly. Hi, Gonzo. I'm Moxie. Yes. We have Angus, though, so we're good with the with the cranky. Okay, two down. Let's see who we get on the next one. I really like that we got the green airport. I, I love the color of the plane. They're all really pretty good. There's not one I don't like. But I do like the green. Oh, drinking my tea on these loading screens, trying to kind of wake myself and my voice up a little bit. <sighs> you know the drill, Orville. <laughs> yeah. Too bad there isn't uh, like a repeat button. Like, just talk to him and say, "Let's just do what we just did." <laughs> I think I might have done. Speaking of Christmas, like I was a little bit ago, might have done kind of a dumb thing. I haven't made treats for my husband to take into work in years. And um, I've, I've felt bad the last couple of years because a few of his employees have given him some goodies to bring home. <laughs> I said, why don't I make like fudge this year? I have my grandmother's recipe for never fail fudge. Oh, hello. It's really yummy. It's easy. It's not hard to make at all. So I said, how many, you know, people are we looking at? And it's only 20 people, which doesn't sound like a lot until I realized I'm going to have to make like eight or 10 batches of fudge. It makes five pounds of fudge, but high static. So we're getting just the cranky grumpies today, huh? Um, it, but it's like a nine by 13 pan is what it makes. And I felt like a half a pan would be a good size to give. <laughs> so I'm going to spend the whole weekend before th uh, Christmas making batch after batch of fudge. I could try doubling it. I just haven't done that before. Oh, the tea table. I like that table. So <clears throat> that's what I'll be doing the weekend uh, before Christmas. But the good thing is, because I'll be doing that, I get out of cooking all weekend. I told my husband the only way I could do it was if I... Uh, didn't have to cook dinner or Sunday breakfast. <laughs> so he was cool with that. Any any excuse for takeout. <laughs> yeah, I'm going to pause this recording. I need to go turn on our heater, maybe get a bathrobe. I'm starting to get chilly. Be right back. All right, I'm back. And I just uh, was joined by my little cranky kitty, Scarlet. <laughs> She's decided she's ready to finish her uh, breakfast. <laughs> so hopefully she will uh, be a good girl and not yell and scream at us while we're trying to villager hunt. Okay, Orville, no more crankies. Time for takeoff, please. Think. Peppy or Jock? Peppy or Jock? Man, if I could stumble across Dom again, I'd be so happy. I may have to get his amiibo. So, I'm so annoyed. I was looking at Target Online the other day and they had some of the Series 5 amiibos available. You could purchase them and have them delivered. And I thought, oh, I don't know. I'll, I'll think about it. And then I checked again yesterday morning. All gone. <laughs> you snooze, you lose. 
Okay, let's look for a message in the bottle first. Uh, not over there. Okay. Aww. Come on, I need some new recipes. Well, let's go see who we have. Actually, I didn't even look to see where the fire was. Oh, there we go. They're hiding. How dare they? How dare? Um, excuse me? <laughs> uh, deja vu? <laughs> Gonzo, you say? Gee, never met you before. <laughs> Okay, I, I feel like the game's telling us something. I don't... I, I He's adorable, but I don't need another Cranky right now. <laughs> and definitely not the same one twice. That's funny. I'm gonna have to break down and buy some Nook Miles tickets today. I can just tell. It's gonna be one of those days. I'm slowly building up my Nook Miles. It's like I get a little above 20,000 Nook Miles and then it's like, oh, I need to buy this and this and this. <laughs> but I always seem to have enough for what I'm doing, so that's okay. It was just weird to go to, you know, over 170,000 Nook Miles to down to 20,000. <laughs> I still do not regret restarting my island. The only... The, it's not even a real regret, but the only thing I wish is that I had crafted some of my um, uh, seasonal decor for this time of year. I'd love to have the wreaths and stuff. But that's okay. Oh, and we'll have to find out if I can still make a snow boy. <laughs> I got pretty good at it last year. I learned making the smaller ones was actually a little bit easier. And then once I got the Nook Miles reward for making however many you had to make perfectly, I, I just didn't care. And had some fun making little fat-bodied ones with little heads, or <laughs> smaller bodies with bigger heads. <laughs> oh, I love the kangaroo. I think they're adorable. I don't think any of them are peppy. Probably hard to be peppy with a little baby in your pouch. Hi, Carrie. Oh, you're so cute. I really like you, Carrie. Sorry, I, I don't need your personality type right now. Let's look for our message. <sighs> I think they are so cute. And it's like a little twofer. You get two villagers for one. Whoa, that's a big fish. Is that a sturgeon? It's like I can't pass up a really big fish. Oh. <laughs> I don't think this will be right either. We'll see if he sees it. No. Okay. Oh, why am I having trouble? There we go. Come on, you can see that fishy. There. Oh, I didn't get it. It was, I bet it was. The special fish seemed to bite. Uh, like you have less reaction time when they bite. I've caught a few though. Stovetop Glockenspiel, do you require assistance? Uh, yeah, ready to go home. <laughs> I love his sayings. Right. Come on, Orville. Happier jock, please. You know the drill, Orville. Let's just not play coy like you have to ask what I'm planning on doing. 
Alrighty, thank you. Oh. Man, I feel like I could go right back to sleep. <laughs> I gotta wake up. Okay. Thank you, Wilbur. Safe and sound in our landing. Check the beach. Oh. Which little penguin are you? There's so many I don't know. With the little earmuffs. Aw, hi, Chabwick. I'm sorry, sweetie, I don't need another lazy. Oh, you're neat. He's so cute. But yeah, I just got rid of one of my three lazies. I just... <laughs> just because it's the uh, personality type I can relate with the most, doesn't <laughs> mean I should fill my island full of them. Mm, nothing. I mean, I guess we got one already. Yeah, the tea table. I will probably use that in my house. Let's go. Yep, yep. Already. This could turn out to be a really long video. It might have to be like a two-parter. <laughs> oh, let's hope not. How many tickets do I have? Still got eight. So we've used six. But I feel like one was wasted because I got the same guy twice. Oh, don't play coy. You know where I want to go. Already. Oh, I have to remember to check turnip prices today, too. I want to sell them. I feel like if I don't do it early in the week, I have a tendency to, it's like, forget about them and then last minute rush trying to sell them. I had only a few last week and I sold them for a little bit of a loss, but like, I, I, I hardly bought any because I forgot about it until just before noon and I my pockets were full and I didn't have very many bells on me, so I only bought a few hundred. <laughs> oh, well at least we got a money rock island. I guess we will hit those rocks. Checking for a message, checking for a villager. There's the campfire over there. Hey, buddy, you have Drago's shirt on. Hi, Chester. I've seen you on my Paradise Island waiting for a vacation home. Okay, so I'm going to need a fruitable. Now, this rock I don't think ever has money in it. I've um, always tried breaking it open and come up empty. I mean, hitting it before breaking it open. Man, I should have gone to visit Katrina before this. Because if I'd gotten a good fortune with bells, I wonder how much more I could have gotten with these. And I never trust me that with my back to the water, so I have to do the whole digging. Because <laughs> I still somehow seem to slide and miss it, but... Not a bad island. I'll take it. <laughs> I've been burning through my bells with my moving of buildings and such. Whoop, get you. All the bells. And I'll do it over here. I'm just not fast enough with the uh, controller to push my character forward. I, I need my little security holes. <laughs> <laughs> you 
If it were just regular stone and iron, I probably wouldn't care as much. But when it comes to my bell bags, I have to get them all. Let's try this. <laughs> Watch me go right between that crevice. No, I'm good. <laughs> Well, I feel like I'm getting my nook, nook miles worth out of this island. Okay, just two more. I have to play more at night as well. I haven't been playing a lot at night. I did have Celeste last night, so I've learned the first recipe she gives us, which is the wand recipe. And I had some shooting stars, so I have to remember to uh, run my beach. But I haven't been uh, going to Mystery Islands at night to see if I can get on, like, Tarantula Island. Does anybody know when or why they got rid of the um, rare, like, hybrid flower island? Like, I didn't know they had gotten rid of that for the longest time. I'm like, okay, I think I'm going to go back too far. Eh, it's all right. I remember looking for that a lot when I was on my first island. I would just spend, like, hours every week in Nook Miles tickets. Oh, we gotta... There will be. Hold on. I forgot we have to combine our bags. I was just wasted so much time looking for the rare, f rare hybrid island that I never got it. And then I learned that they got rid of it. So I never knew why. This kind of reminds me, like, I had never played the older versions of the game, but I've seen others play, like, New Leaf and stuff, and just nothing would stack. Like, out, you know, the fruit, mine, nothing. You had to go through and, like, whoops, stack everything manually in your bag. Okay, that's good. We have room now to pick stuff up. Just do this one, get a thousand... And then we could tidy the rest up later when I deposit it. Well, it wasn't a villager, but it was lots of bells. So that was nice. Might as well grab that. Okay. Bye. <laughs> We're definitely finding a few cute villagers. I'm ready. Take me and my money bags home. Well, that was a good island. Orville, but not quite what we were looking for. So let's try again. It's too bad we can't find... Um, I don't think we can find villagers on Captain's Islands, can we? No, I don't think so. But now I kind of want to test that out. You know what? Maybe after this flight we'll take a tour. I don't think that's a thing. I would have heard that that was a thing, wouldn't I? <laughs> Be nice if the uh, the new characters added would show up there, but I, I really don't think it's a thing. But now I have to test to see if it's a thing. <laughs> oh my. Well, what what are you? Another grumpy or cranky. I was hoping with the little hoodie, maybe he was a jock. Hi, Rooney. You're cute, Rooney. I like your bangs. 
Sorry that you are not a jock. Oh, fossil fragment. Can't. Oh, and I almost didn't look for the message in the bottle. I'm being very forgetful. Okay. You didn't need the stick, but okay. Mm, I'm starting to feel even lazy about running and looking for the message in the bottle. Oh, that's sad. Mm, nope. Don't see one over there unless it's hidden. Okay. Should we do a quick cap and tour? I really don't think... Nah, I'm not going to do it. I, I don't think you can find them on those islands. If we run out of Nook Miles tickets, we will. Hi, Scarlet. You going to come lie down? Oh, please don't go in the litter box. I think she's going in the litter box. Well, I've already scooped it for you. It's all ready. We do at least keep it in a cabinet, so I'm a little... <laughs> uh, it's a little... Uh, Covered up. Yep, she's going in the little litter box. Well, <laughs> and I'm slurring my words. <laughs> You'd think I was drinking a Long Island iced tea and not a hot tea. Oh, time for takeoff. So if you hear any scratching in the sound of litter flying, <laughs> it's Miss Scarlet. Yeah, I am still just not awake yet. I th I've actually gotten a lot of sleep the last couple of nights, and I just, I feel so groggy. <laughs> oh, baby girl, that is loud. Who do we have? Um, I can't remember what personality trait he is. Okay, he's a jock. Um, Sly might not have been my first pick, but that's who we need. <laughs> you are? I didn't know it was real. I heard the best abs on the planet come from there. Hoorah! <laughs> you know, as much as I want to stay here and train, I can only build so much muscle by gathering stuff. What would be really cool is if I could live near someone that inspires me to go big on bulking up. I am not that someone, dude. Now, if you want inspiration on eating snacks and being a couch potato, I'm your gal. <laughs> your triceps are just astonishing. Well, that's one word for him. Hoorah. Come train on my island. Uh, train with you and your glorious triceps? I can't turn that down, turtle time. Here I come. Just you wait. We're totally going to push each other to muscular new weights. Hoorah. Oh, we'll be sworn rivals of Swoldum and best buds in buffness. It's going to be mega epic, just like us. Well said. <laughs> he doesn't know me at all. Oh, no, we're not going to see 30-pack abs. Yep, go bug that Tom Nook guy. Well, there it is. My, actually, I think he is kind of cute. I, I like the camouflage. Um... So let's just look for our message in the bottle, I guess. I'll probably stay behind after I end this recording and uh, <laughs> chop some wood, hit some rocks. Great, we do have a message. Let's see what we got. From Muscular Craftsman Bill. <laughs> Jungle wall. Oh, I don't know it yet. All right. Well, thank you so much for coming along on my villager hunt with me. We, we accomplished our goal and got a jock. So hopefully... Oh, I don't have that bug yet. Hopefully we will get a peppy on the next one soon. Take care and tune in later because... Oh, tune in later. Check in on my channel later. I'm going to do some more um, Happy Home Paradise design uh, probably after I do a little house cleaning around here. So I hope you tune in to watch that and I hope you enjoyed this. Thank you so much and take care.